Hey everybody! What's up? This is Team Daisy's Revenge. And here's our machine. Um, this is Alyssa. Hi. Hey. Hello. Harry. And our machine is cool. Rank 29th. But we got DQ'd one time, so we're actually like number five. We made these awesome cards that show our info. And there's our amazing poster. So here we have our machine. It completes three functions. Launching the middle section forward, which knocks Donkey Kong and Bowser into the star, which then launches Mario and Luigi into our tube, which also releases these sweeping arms to collect the points, as shown. We are very hopeful, because last night, oh, La uh, it also looks really pretty. Has that paint in it? We have two actuators to shoot the star because it's faster, and this springs to launch Mario and Luigi. And I made this spool. And it pulls in the arms. Yep, and lock them in our zone with these um, dowel fingers. And something that differentiates us from other teams is the fact that we don't knock Donkey Kong and Bowser out of the way. Um, we decided that based off of a potential points analysis, we would be able to still have a positive amount of points towards the end, even with keeping Donkey Kong and Bowser within our zone, if we collected the points and got the star and launched Mario and Luigi. So we've been averaging, um, during qualifying rounds, we averaged around 50 points, um, but last night after some testing, uh, we averaged about 60 points. So we had an increase from qualifying to our final time. Um, we've actually made some changes since last night. This was printed yesterday and last night we made some changes. There used to be an arm over the top, but as you can see, that's not there anymore. And so what had been happening was that this, we added two actuators within here, and these two actuators were launching it so hard that there was a, yeah, there was a bounce back. And so the bounce back didn't allow this um, lid to clear. There's a, um, another bar here. It didn't allow the lid to clear this section. So we were having issues with that. So we ended up adding a weight, and then we had to add weights to the bottom because it was too heavy. And then we figured out, wait, why don't we just take this off, see at what point that needs to launch forward, and then go from there. Much more consistent results. Staging area, and then there's three on deck areas for right before. Right. Do you need to bring a poster? Uh, I don't think so. I think it's just your machine. Okay. Thanks, Adam. <laughs> Dr. Sickles is judging us. Well, always, just because we're Daisy. It's Daisy's revenge. We have that. There you go. Know. If someone else gets her, you know, she's her enemy that way. Yeah, he likes the cards. Okay. Oh. Thank you. He's leaving. He's leaving. So much swag. And this top is so good at time. There he goes. All right, I'm going to do some hidden camera observations of our competition. We're going against team 8, 41, and 63. So I'm going to go check them out. This is team 8. They have Mario and Luigi launcher. Uh, a swinging arm. Secret device they wouldn't tell me about, and like different different stuff. They're not they're not good. They're giving out candy. We can, we got them. There's the our other competition. Okay. In the yellow. There. How are you? Oh. They're good. 
Let me get out of your way there. They are doing something with the peach. And they're, they're losers. We, we could take them. There's a competition. Team 63. They got a peach grabber and some other stuff. Objectives. Let's see. Push villains. Sweep villains. We can take them.